hi, it's come to our attention recently that there are people out there who actually aren't quite sure what tripod is and what we do and who we are. Yeah. But what we are is, um, what, well, it's like being locked on a stage with nowhere to go for 70 to 80 minutes. You know what I mean? Don't it's say cabaret, don't say cabaret. Not allowed to say cabaret? Well, we know it's cabaret. Is, so that, we, is that difficult to follow? That's Yon. Okay. Tell us a little bit about yourself, Yon. Uh, I live. I live. <laughs> I don't know, what else? What All right, well, well, I, let's... It. So, I'm Scott, right? I'm kind of the conceptual engine room, creative sort of powerhouse uh, of, the, of the act. Yeah. Uh, I bring... You're nodding to that. What? You're going to take that? What? I wasn't listening. No, oh, I was right. thinking about something else. Oh, right. I'm going, yeah, must pick up milk. Milk. Must <laughs> pick up bread. Yeah. And this is Gatsy. Hi. And that's what he does. Yeah. Um, um, nods hey. whilst thinking of something else. Right, that's all I do. Oh, it's one of the things. One of the many things. I sometimes shake my head. Do you come from the land down under? Because nothing says musician like sheet music. Um, how about how did we meet? That's no, I don't want to. I don't care how we met. Always, people always want to know that. No, how did we meet? Well, we uh, we met through friends. Well, I met him through friends, and I met you, not through friends. No. Well, we, we were doing musicals at, at uni, which was pretty glamorous. I met Yoni during a production of Man of La Mancha, in which I got cast because I was the only one who knew how to play the guitar. We sort of, because we started not really singing our own songs, so we did this thing where we were kind of having a bit of a go at Oasis about how these songs have the same chords and stuff. We uh, were on a, a talent quest called, which was called Red Faces. It was a big deal at the time, because mm -hmm. we grew up watching this show, and we mm -hmm. knew, you know, the, the, guy, the guy called Red who... who uh, Usually, you know, uh, gives everyone a three. Gave us a what did we give us? What did we give us? Big six. A six. Big six. Yeah. It was kind of the only six way to get on. It was, only, it was the only way to get on telly back then, really, wasn't it? Yeah. Really, or you know, or you had to be good. <laughs> is a power trio. <laughs> I've heard about these power trios. Off the success of that one song, <laughs> we um, we were considered the next big thing. We were ready for the big time. Yeah, we were very young and naive and enthusiastic. Mm. Bouncing around on the streets in coloured outfits. Bit of a warning to all the ladies and everyone over on that side, gets a little bit sexy in the green corner, okay? <laughs> so, uh, uh, so, so strap yourselves in. Here we go. It's always a bit awkward when you have to explain to someone that you're actually that you're famous. You know, when yeah. when when, you, when someone comes up to you in the street and goes, "Hey," and then their friend goes, are, are, "What? Are these guys famous?" And then their friend has to, and then we just stand there. I don't want to interrupt or anything, and yet you do. Do you think the dancing's appropriate? Could you not encourage them, please? Yeah. And then what happened next, Scotty? So we've done a few TV shows as well. One called Skit House, which you might probably see videos of that, which is a bit of a trip down haircut memory lane for us. <laughs> um, and facial hair. And youth. Oh. And kids these days, they come up to us on the street and they go, Oh, you're in Skit House. You're from Skit House, they often say, in that accent. A lot of people have worked very hard to contribute to the show. And there's probably a lot of information in the credits that you didn't know. So why don't you take a break from watching us and read the credits? Read the credits, yeah. Forget about us, just read the credits, yeah. No, I'm still not sure what to look at. It's the mirror? Or the light? Or it's, or like the a, lens. it's like an interview. Oh, it's the lens. Yeah. Look at yeah. The person who's oh, it's not the right. yeah. well, Theoretically, I should be able to bring myself to a standing position using only my mind. <laughs> right, so at some point you're just going to stand up. Yeah. There's always a hierarchy. Who's the boss? Who says, no, that stinks? Yeah, I'm the boss. Yeah. Uh, I think it's me, actually, yeah. you're talking about. I just do it with silences. <laughs> Can I have another go? No. <laughs> uh, 
The other thing we have done in our time is a show called TV show called Sideshow, which was on every Saturday night for a season. Mm. And I was really proud of that show. That was more. That was a lot of cabaret, burlesque, circus, you know, vaudeville kind of thing. And um, that was good fun to do, you know. I don't know why, love it like I do. All the trouble you put me through. Sixteen candles, they're on the wall. And here I am, just a fool of it all. I wanna know, won't you tell me that I'm in go to sort of taboo places you have to be be able to be funny you know that's to me I don't think anything's off limits if you can think of something funny or that somehow rings true about you know mm. the topics how Gatesy how would you describe tripod we're never alone we're backing each other up we got the love of three men A whole lot of love pulling together. Three men. We've been making uh, music uh, and funny things, and often funny music for about 15 years or so. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That is how you do it. All right, hands on heads. Could you not encourage them, please? And what else do we do? Oh, yeah, TV themes. Do a bit of TV themes. Yeah. Mm. We're trying to usher back in a golden age of TV themes. Oh, I think we're doing all right. So many questions in my mind. What would be a good pickup line? Why had a hot girl just come in if the Hulk fought Spider-Man? Who would win? Well, you really saved the show there, fella. Thanks for that. <laughs> Give me... I was hoping that this would open a secret door. <laughs> was my mother into Bert Bacharach? <laughs> Maybe. Yes or no? Yes. <laughs> Am I good at sport? Sure. It's Lucy. Yes. People often uh, just sort of hit the humour and don't realise what's going on musically with Tripod, but I've always been very impressed with their um with their musicianship and just know each other's voices so well so in this arrangement there was a lot of it's weird it was like being like, you know there with a three-way marriage i will meet you in the middle of the air i will lay down in pastures So we just basically have carried on like this for about a decade and a half. Mm. Yeah, it's the one thing we have in common, really. <laughs> right, that's what we do. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. that's good. Okay, bye. Yeah. This is, this is going to sell a lot of tickets. <laughs>